I voiced my concern, people have heard it, and that's that, you know what I mean? The, continuing to complain about it doesn't really solve anything. They're either gonna listen or they're not gonna listen. It has nothing to do, like, it's out of my hands now. I'll probably make a video about it, though, at some point, and put it on YouTube with, like, more compiled thoughts after I, like, sit down for a little bit. Uh, off stream, but we'll see. Or I'll make, like, a Reddit post or something. They have no direction of wasting time. I don't even think it's like that they have a lack of direction because clearly they got it. Like, they got whatever system they got done. But I think the system comes from a place of, like, disrespect for the player. Like, I don't feel like it values the time of the player. And I think that's, a, like, the entire point of a mastery system is to show, like, that you respect your players and you want to give them something cool for their, like, time investment. And I feel like uh, the Pred player base has been very lenient. Uh with them like with delays and things like that you know first it's like just wait till season two or whatever wait till you know xx and, and y and we'll add x y and z and then it doesn't happen and then they're like still lenient about it and then uh you know they do this and it's just kind of like a slap in the face what system the affinity system basically happy it's like a battle pass where you only unlock the skin if you pay for the premium <laughs> like the premium track They made it the John Wick smite from Fortnite, dude. You have to pay for it to get it. It's fucking terrible. If you pay, you can only get the skin if you pay for it. You go, go take a look. I don't have to link anymore, but go take a look. Exclamation point patch. There's a link in the patch notes if you want to look from there, but otherwise it's just in their blog. Go take a look. It's not good. It is the worst mastery system I've ever seen. Affi oh, sorry, affinity system. It's not a mastery system. It's an affinity system. It's the fucking same thing. I literally said if it's not changed by Tuesday, I'm not playing the game. Like, that's that's my opinion on it. So, like I, like I said, I'm not gonna, like, rip on them or anything. I've already spoken my piece. And, like, that's that's it. I can only do what I can do, you know? But, like, that's a big system that a lot of people were waiting for, and I think it was let down to a, like... I honestly want to say, like, more than 90% of the community are let down by that. I should have waited till I leveled up. I was C4, but I'm not. Oh, you know, he probably stole some of the two camp. What are they doing? You missed it. Uh, the skins for the mastery are effectively locked behind the paywall. That's like the easiest way I can explain it. I would just say go read the blog post that they put out about it uh, this morning. Maybe this game keeps doing dumb shit. Like I said, I think people have been very lenient and I think this is like not something that they're going to be lenient on. Because this is actually just... It's just a disrespect to the players. It, it truly is. They still have the ability to correct it, though. I give them the benefit of the doubt. Like I said, I, I hope they correct it. I really do. Because I don't want to not play Pred. I enjoy Pred. I really do. But I can't play a game that doesn't reward my time. Or I even think has the potential to reward my time. the hype for the new skins and this happens the thing is the skins aren't even bad like that's the thing the skins aren't even bad like the skins themselves actually look really good they just need to be earnable that's it i'll force this flash i'm about to be six so i don't really need flash
Uh. <laughs> Field tech has been 200 hours in spite of, uh... uh. Wait, what? They want five dollars when I drop some merch. Well, like that's the thing. Like I feel like you—they could have made the emotes. Like there's like emotes in it. Like you could have just made the emotes like a five dollar pack. Like you pay five dollars for all the emotes for the hero or something like that, or for like three emotes for each hero, or whatever. Like you could have just done that, and it would nobody would have said anything. It would have been they would have been like, oh, cool, some more stuff that you can buy, and it would have flushed out the shop more. You would have had an extra tab for emotes or whatever. Would have been fine. Nobody would have said anything. That's why I just don't under I just don't get it. Like I just don't get the end game there. Brother just keeps running from me. At least I traded it. He should be dead. This shit's, uh... They even change it, it's unforgivable. I don't think it's unforgivable if they change it, because at least they, they, like, listen. You know what I mean? But if they listen and then they don't change it, I think that's, like, unforgivable in my opinion. Pursuits won't change, I think that's one of the mods. They seem pretty stuck in the system. Uh, well, I'm gonna say the mods aren't part of the dev team. And I would disagree, like, uh, unless it's from an actual dev, I, I wouldn't take it super heavily. Even if it is from a mod. Really offended with having to play 130 games for level 10. I don't really care if it takes a long time. Like 130 is quite a lot, I think. But if it was like 100, like I wouldn't really care. Like at least it's something. But at least you can grind for it. Like I said, I said it the other day. I think like 50 to 70 is like reasonable. I think like 100 to 150 is like a little unreasonable. But at least like even that's not as bad as like having to pay for it. Like not only do you have to grind a lot, you have to pay for it too. Like that that is actually like doubly criminal. Like, I was like, don't do this dumb system, and then they did something even worse. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that's how it feels. So this is the community disappointed. Like, like I said, I don't think this is like small compared to like the other stuff. Like it, the community is usually pretty lenient, I would say. This is like, when you get a backlash like this heavily, it's not like a one community wants this and then one community wants this. It's like everybody in the community can, or like not everybody, but like 99% of the people in the community don't like it. You know that it's wrong. Like I said, when, when even Steve is not shilling, you know it's wrong. And like, I like Steve. But he's a little bit of a shill sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. And like, I think he knows that. And I think like, that's fine. You know, he really enjoys the game. He's not trying to shit on it. But like when even like somebody like that is like, this is a shit system, you know, it's like extra shit. I think monetization strategy is uh, his base. I don't know who it is. I mean, I would assume it's somebody that has to do with like marketing, right? I would assume it's like a marketing person. I don't know who would set that kind of stuff as a dev, but I'm sure like some stuff has to get approved, right? Should we 
by so many delays. I mean, almost every game gets rejected by so many on the first apply. That's not really that actually. Th that's not that crazy to be honest. Smite the Xbox used to be like fucking three patches behind because they used to get rejected by Xbox all the time. So that's actually like not that crazy. In this wave, uh, worth ability 25% total health as magic or uh, damage if he goes magic power. Uh, I think it's 10% max HP and then just bonus magical damage. I don't know if the magical damage is scaling to your HP. Like, I don't know if the, the scaling is your magic or is, uh, your max HP. I, I, I thought the same thing. I was a little confusing the way they wrote it, so I actually don't know. I wish I had a better answer. The pay to essentially get, uh... EA for the mastery system. No, no, no. You have to pay for the ma you have to pay for the mastery system itself. Like, regardless of paying for the game, I don't care about paying for the game. It's early access. I'm fine with paying for the game. But the ma the ability to unlock the skin from the mastery, you have to you have to pay five dollars per hero. There's any way that they he didn't improve. I mean, they have multiple, uh, what's it called, I think. Multiple CEOs, so it's very possible that it didn't go over, go off him. Like I said, I don't, I don't know who would handle that. I don't know who would oversee that. I don't know who would put that into the game and approve it. Uh, but, like, that's, like, I, I just, I don't know. I, I actually can't believe that even made it to live. Like, or even, like, the option to, like, announce that to somebody. It's technically not on live yet, so like I can't say that it's on live, but it's it's like kind of crazy that that even somewhat got remotely through any type of testing or anything. Is that only well in EA or permanent? Until like the end of season three, there's supposed to be like a token system that you get per like level, for example, like every like five levels, maybe you get one token that you can use to unlock the premium uh, of one hero like mastery or something like that which is still like a shit system but at least it's not like as bad it's still a shit fucking system though and i think they're looking at like putting that into the game as soon as possible so maybe it's like one extra week or like a week after the mastery system comes out like they'll add that into the game but like it's still a shit fucking system they have like some announcement today or something uh, about it. I shouldn't say I know, but they said like it, like they told me in the creator Discord that they are talking about it and they might try to add it in like sooner, so that like that part of it is like at least in the game. But even still, like it's still a bad system. You want the apology? You can get these. How about that, GM? <laughs> I don't want an apology. I just want them to actually listen for once. That's it. Like, they, they, they listen sometimes, but, like, I don't feel like they listen on big choices like this. And I think this is their chance to... Like, I think, like, they've lost a lot of favor with the community in general over the past couple seasons. I think this is a chance for them to listen and get some of that favor back by actually listening. It's gonna be a token or something to get it for free. Why is it bad? Well, let's say I wanted to unlock characters, but I didn't have a token. I now have to pay for it if I don't have a token. Like I'm level 50 right now or something, and I play the game every single day. And let's say it's like five games per or like five levels per token. That means I have to play like an ungodly amount of games, and I can only unlock 10 mastery skins. And like the higher you level, the the lower it or um, what's it called, the longer it takes to level up. So like. The more I unlock, the harder it takes, and then it like kind of forces me to pay money, and that's like, that's a shit system. It's not like a set rate, because the amount of XP per level is not set. I was just kind of beat my ass.
Fuck. I missed one auto. Being worse, each token only unlocks one tier. No, I think it would just be like you unlock the premium pass. I don't think it would be one tier. It would be the whole tier. I don't I don't know why they would do it that way. That would be even worse. But I guess that is some way that they could make it worse. <laughs> that is technically a way that they could make it worse. But the ledge was smooth. Yeah, unfortunately that Richter was there. Feels bad. But then I guess that is a way to make it worse. <laughs> So the greatest making part of this game part of that free stuff remedies this. I think for me it would. I think for the majority of people it would. If the if they just made the skin like the last reward in the free section, that would be fine. And I think like the crowns or whatever as like a five dollar thing, because the crowns show up on every skin and things like that. Like I think that's fine. And like the emotes, I think that's fine personally. Some people might not like it, but I think for me that's fine. And I think for most people it's probably fine. But like the skin itself, I think should always be earnable, uh, for free without having to do like any like you're not jumping through hoops. that T2 recolors are even less, you know, it's kind of true. That's just unfortunate timing. I missed too many autos, I could have killed him probably. Not worth using flash. Messages can always be free. Well, the thing is, they're not free. It, it costs me my time. Like, it, that's the thing. They're not even free. Like, it costs me my time. And that's the trade-off. Like, some skins you pay money for, and you can use them immediately without spending any time. So you, you spend currency. I don't want to spend currency on something that I, I spend my time on. Like, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's just different. Like, my time is the investment in that. And then if you want to get the other stuff, like the emotes and stuff, like I, if I, you know, maybe I'll buy it on like, a, like I play Gideon a lot, right? My most played hero. Maybe I'll buy it on Gideon just so I can wear the crown on Gideon or something. Like, you know what I mean? Or like somebody that I really enjoy playing. Maybe I'll buy it on that. Like, I'm not going to buy it on every character, obviously, but maybe I'll spend $5 a platinum to get it on, on characters I really enjoy playing. So I can really show it off. You know? But like, it, I don't know. I, I just, I just dislike it. And it just feels like... There's something you see and you're like, that's predatory, and that's something that I can look at, and I can tell you that that's predatory and not in the player's best interest in any capacity. And I think it's actively a mistake to put that to live client. I, I really do. You putting, you having to pay for something that you put time into is crazy. A hundred percent agree called Pred for a reason, I guess. Fair point. Oh, I'm doing the gaming. Gotta get that trip ski. Probably the most money grab your predatory systems you've, you've seen. I think this is like beyond anything that uh, I could have expected, honestly. Like I could predict what they were gonna put into the game. I, I could never have predicted that it would be something like a system so poor. And that's like not including like, like that's including like all the stuff that they've done up to this point. Like contract system, all that stuff, pay DA, whatever. Up to this point, I don't think I could have ever imagined they would put, or like even think to put in a system so poorly in the in the game, especially considering that a lot of the devs used to be like former players of Paragon, and one of the biggest issues with Paragon was that people said it was too monetized. Like I just, like I could have never imagined that in my mind. And it like sucks because I like I, like I said I really do enjoy the game, and like not playing the game is actively like a negative for me. Unfortunate die one second on all. That sucks. Or 
and OP apologize for their expensive skins. Did they apologize? I know they gave people money back for skins that people paid for that were too expensive. I don't know if they like necessarily apologize. I guess that's kind of an apology. Probably a part of their funding deals. What do you mean? Hopefully the tokens into the bundles, then eventually maybe it'll be worth to go to the $100 version. I mean... By their logic, uh, one token is equivalent to 500 currency, right? So one token is worth $5. If that's like the system. The gameplay with the systems feel like a kick in the teeth. It just feels disrespectful. It really does. So you get to get you get to have to give up me to more of your money. <laughs> uh, some people actually have that take. Apparently, some people were in the Discord calling people poor if they didn't want to pay for it. Apparently, some people actually have that take. So free loot crate system. Op doesn't have a loot crate system, unless you meant like Paragon. But Paragon, I'm pretty sure, couldn't you get like, couldn't you? get stuff that like you already had i think that's a fucking terrible system at least you could earn shit for free publishers have to say uh, in free play game annotation systems i mean in terms of systems or pricing because that's like two different things because they could be like all right you have to get the charge for skins but then like are they setting the price for those skins as well Fuck him up, Crunch. I, I don't, like, I, I'm genuinely curious. I'm not even trying to be, like, sarcastic or anything. Like, I actually don't know. Because I'm not a dev. And I would at least, like, uh, somewhat understand it a little bit at that point. Because they're not even good enough to justify any monetization. That's not, I think some of them are fine. Like, the TB skin, like, the Gideon skin, like, I would be fine. I don't think they're worth the price that they are currently. But, like, if they were, like, paid only, I think that's fine. But, like, the Countess recolors and shit like that, like, the Drongo recolor, like, why is that not earnable in-game? It makes no sense. OP's like that. All the, all the, like, recolors and shit you can earn in-game. You get free of premium where you wouldn't get any duplicates of Paragon. Interesting. I mean, I guess, like, if it was just skin stuff, it probably wouldn't be that bad. But if it was, uh... Because I think Rainbow Six uses a similar system. If it's just skin stuff, that's fine. But I'm pretty sure the reason Paragon system was a failure was because, like, the items in the game itself were locked behind the loot boxes that you could get duplicates from. Which I think is the biggest issue with it. But if it was just like skin stuff, like Smite does that with skins, like you can get, you can't get uh, duplicates, but they have like a bunch of loot boxes for skins, but it's just skins and cosmetics. There's nothing that actually in, like impacts the game, which is fine. And you get a lot of that stuff for free. Like you get a lot of stuff for free. Like I've spent $20 in Smite. I have over 600, or sorry, not over 600. I have over 900 skins in Smite, I'm pretty sure. Something like that. Which is like almost half of the skins in the game. it takes the appreciate the amount of work it puts into a recolor to artist at work not bad you're kind of right you're spitting you're spitting i should appreciate the color wheel being changed from red to purple on latest fuck tj it's 2 30 what are you talking about usually i'm on to like three or four An extra currency for unlocking stuff. Well, that's like the other thing too, is like, I feel like a lot of this stuff could have just been avoided by having a free-to-play currency. And then they could have charged free-to-play currency for the skins, which is fine, because that's how Smite does it. But you get it like at a stable rate and you get it for every single game, no matter who you're playing, etc. Like, I think that's fine. And then you can also ha use that to unlock like the emote stuff. All of that stuff could have just been part of like the store and just been like a free-to-play store. 
and it would have been fine. And then you have other stuff to grind too. And you have different things to grind. And you use that as like a sink so that people are forced to either like buy that stuff with the free-to-play currency or keep grinding. It's just like extra extra options. Oh, baby, it's just too easy. When you're him, you're him. Oh, dude, he's already here. Fuck. I didn't think he was here yet. At least I got a tower. Maybe I should have just died the tower instead. I thought he was still in the steps. Some people want to see the world burning. He's pray for my downfall. That's fucked up, DJ, man. That's fucked up. Don't rage against me. Rage against the system. Six loss in a row. Fucking scam. I don't know. Gunner's not having an issue. Let's see if I get my, like, fifth loss in a row today. Let's go. I finally won one. Holy fuck. W. I am the system. I'm not the system, bro. I could never be the system. I'm not that fucked up. Oh, you gave me a thousand? Dude, that's so nice of you. Look at us, man. Who would've thought? I'll have to return the favor sometime. I don't actually want blue. I guess he's a solo laner, so he's gonna give it to me anyways. I'll take it, I guess. Are we playing TTS, and if so, when? Uh, I would like to play TTS today, at some point. Uh, not sure when, it depends on when we can get people. I think Ego said he's free most of the afternoon, although I wanna eat after stream, and then I'm probably gonna make a YouTube video, so. Probably like after that, probably be like six, like 5.30, 6 o'clock. What's TTS, tabletop sim? I don't know if you can stream or not. Yeah, it'll probably be like 6 o'clock, probably, Greddy, I would say. Seems like a reasonable time. You do a short run then? Sounds good. Goes to landlording. I mean, it's not exactly interesting. It's what you would expect. You go past six, but not much. I mean, it depends on everybody else's schedule, too. I just know other people don't get home until, like, six o'clock, so... At the earliest, that's probably when it would be. I'll, uh... If you're playing, I'll hop in and say something or something like that. And I'll let you know. Save your spot. I got you. I'm just here gaming on the Drongo. I didn't realize RDC was uh, 7 and 1. How's he behind in farm? I want a group and fight. I feel like we have a really strong fight. You just Decker stun in the Drongo grenade and we just kill somebody.
gaming. That Decker stun was fat. That was a fat Decker stun. Unfortunate the Feng Mao lived. He must have got his shield up. We just do orb. Do orb because somebody has a D left. Sarah to come. We burn it, we burn it, we burn it. We got it, boys, we got it. so hard. Fuck! I missed two autos. That could have been a penta, dude. I saw the penta and then I fucking choked it. Fuck! Aim to update us all early next week. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. We made a response. We'll see what they do, like I said. We'll see what they do until Tuesday. They have up until Tuesday, though, like for me. We'll see. We'll be full tilt to Tuesday. Like I said, I'm not even like, I'm not gonna be tilted on Tuesday. I'm just gonna play something else. Like that's it. That's, that's what it comes down to. Like I can't, I just can't. Like they have until Tuesday. I'll been play up until Tuesday because the system's not in, the, in place yet. But if it gets added and Tuesday comes around then there's no reason for me to play the game because my time's not like warranted, then I'm not gonna play the game and that's not. Or right, waiting till Tuesday. Yeah, like I said, I have no problem waiting till Tuesday. That was like one of the first things I said. I was like, I'll, I'll wait till Tuesday, but like, if it makes it to live like that, I'm not playing the game. Talk about bread. I mean, I always talk about bread. I'm playing bread. That's my game. The Grissy, please. That guy's dead. It's not just Int. I should have grabbed Grey Buff. What am I talking about? I'm talking about uh, one of the things that they wanted to do for this game. That was supposed to be implemented Tuesday. That was announced today. Left clicks are slapping. Oh, we're left clicking, that's for sure. We do be left clicking. Is blue buff up? I kind of need one. Fuck. First eggs. I mean, that just comes with the job, right? I 
I don't have cleanse. That definitely hit me. Fuck, dude. I just missed too many autos, man. I missed way too many autos there. That's been a pred. Yeah, I already saw it. It just basically says that they're, they're looking at it and they'll have something by Tuesday or like they might have an announcement by Tuesday. At least there's a conversation occurring, you know what I mean? At least that means that there's a conversation occurring. Wait, by the premium pass, add a master skin recolor with VFX changes. Be so worth it. They don't even need like VFX changes. I literally think like the five dollars to like get the extra stuff, like the crowns and stuff, is completely reasonable, and I think that's fine. But the skin itself should be in the in, should be in the free section. Like that's actually it. Like I don't even think they need the token system. I really don't. I don't think you even need to have tokens. I think you can literally just have the crown system be five dollars. Like, it's $5 for the crowns and the emotes. And that's completely reasonable. I think that's actually completely reasonable. And then in the future, if it's like a free-to-play currency or whatever, you can unlock it, all that kind of stuff. Like, that's fine. Or if they still want to do the tokens in the future, it's fine. But I think the main piece of a mastery system is the mastery skin. And that specifically should only be earnable. Like, it, it, sh it should be freely earnable. Like, you should not have to pay for it at all. free they put it next to mastery like i said i think it's not good like i still don't think that's a good system to lock the crowns and all that kind of stuff if it's part of the mastery system i still don't think it's good but it's at least reasonable at the very least reasonable and it, it's hard to be just like a just completely change the system because i don't like you can't just expect them to completely change the system in three or four days like that's a that's a little unreasonable of an ask but just to like make the to like swap one of the rewards with the skin is like completely reasonable. Shit on. <laughs> I think to pay for uh, that shit's dumb as hell. I agree. I agree. We'll see what they do though by Tuesday. Hopefully it gets fixed. Fuck, dude. I missed too many autos, man. I don't think he can end. The Decker should be up. Actually, he might be able to use double wave. Fuck. We go through adjustments. Yeah, they, announced it. they dropped an announcement, but until there's like an actual, like, this is what we're gonna do, it doesn't really mean that much. Because I was gonna play till Tuesday anyways. Like, I'm waiting till Tuesday regardless. Like, no matter what, I'm waiting till Tuesday. At the very least. But we'll see. I might wait. I might not actually make a video today. I might make a video on Tuesday and see if they've changed it. Because I'll give them the benefit of the doubt to change it until then, at the very least. So we'll see. I might not even make a video today about it. This issue with Affinity that you have to you have to pay to unlock this like the actual mastery part of it, like the skin part. Like you have to pay for that.